For some people who use a flat pack version of DOS with an NVIDIA graphics card, they'll have updated something in their Linux setup and suddenly all their DOS games will have shrunk to the size of a postage stamp. No amount of fiddling with scalers or uninstalling and reinstalling drivers will fix this problem, as it's actually an issue between NVIDIA, OpenGL and Flatpak. I discovered this because when it couldn't output using OpenGL, DOSBox fell back to its surface rendering, and the debug terminal informed me of this. Thanks to Logix over at Linux Uprising, I discovered a solution. The link to the article is in the description for those who prefer reading it instead. Long story short, the Flathub packages were built with OpenGL in mind. So you need to download and install a driver-specific runtime file from the Flathub repository in order to make them work. So if you somehow haven't added the Flathub repository but are using flat packs from elsewhere somehow, do that first. You then need to find out the major and minor numbers for the version of a proprietary graphics driver that you're using. In my case, the major number was in the drivers section, but it varies from distro to distro. If the minor number doesn't happen to be there, open up terminal and type apt cache policy followed by your NVIDIA driver. Those dashes are important. This will spit out the minor number after the major number in the installed section, separated by a dot. Now we need to find those runtime packages on the Flatpak repo. So we enter Flatpak Remote LS Flathub Grep NVIDIA. Probably the sort of command you want to copy and paste. To install the correct runtime, simply type flatpak install flathub org.freedesktop.platform.gl.nvidia, then the major version, and then a dash, and then the minor version number. Ugh, what a mouthful. If a repository has the runtime for your version, it'll download and install it automatically. After that, I didn't even bother rebooting. It just worked. Here's hoping it does for you, random person who happens to be stumbling upon this.